Hello, my name is Jacob Stanley. I'm in my second year teaching eighth grade world history at Montevallo Middle School. Prior to teaching here in Montevallo, I have taught in two other places, Russell County High School, where I taught ninth grade world history close to Phoenix City, Alabama, and Selma High School, where I taught ninth through 11th grade history in Selma, Alabama. Before I taught in Selma, I attended Auburn University, where I received my undergraduate degree in social studies general education in 2016. And prior to attending Auburn, I graduated high school from Hewitt Trustwell High School in Trustville, Alabama, in the Birmingham area. Currently, I live with my wife, Julia, in Helena, Alabama, with our dog, Layla. We got married in July of 2019, which I am so thankful that we got married two, almost two years ago, rather than last year, due to the coronavirus mess that we are currently in. My goals in education are to pursue my master's, which I am currently doing, to further improve my skills as a teacher. I love to learn. If I could just go to school for the rest of my life, learning more history, more instructional technology, more instructional strategies, I would, um, because that's what I'm passionate about. But I'm currently pursuing my master's as a professional educator here at Montevallo. And then eventually, I want to get my doctorate, preferably uh, to go into central office administration, something in the curriculum and instruction department, whether it's curriculum director or instructional coach or instructional director or program specialist. Um, it doesn't really matter, but that's what I'm passionate about is both history and helping other people become better teachers and interest in the curriculum. I became a teacher because when I was in Trustful, I had a teacher in my 11th grade public speaking class named Miss Herring, who retired recently after 47 years in education, who gave a speech about why she became a teacher. And I realized that I agreed with all of those things uh, that she talked about. And so right then and there, I decided to become a teacher, and I have never wavered since then. Over my now five years of teaching, I have worked on preparing my philosophy for teaching, and I've kind of nailed it down into three different steps. My first step is to simply teach the material, whether that's through notes or some type of hands-on activity, I want students to learn the material first. Then I want them to be, to I want the students to re get reinforcement for that learning through some type of hands-on, collaborative, group or partner activity, and then finally assess it, whether it's through a test or a project, which I would prefer because it allows me to be able to see whether they actually know the material better than just memorizing a bunch of answers on the study guide. And so as I go through this class and as I go through my graduate and eventually doctorate programs, I want to be able to improve this philosophy so that I can become a better teacher.